Hello. I thought I would read you another story. I said I would. So, today I'm going to read you Bumpus Jumpus Dinosaur Rumpus by Tony Mitten and Guy Parker Reese. First of all, I bet you want to know if Gertie is here listening. She is. Let's see if I can turn the camera around and you can spot her. Ted's laying down. He's, 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 he's tired. And then if I turn this round, can you see them? We've got Gertie. We've got the Chumleys can't see how we've got and over here Woof has agreed to help us with the camera so that's lovely Woof you're doing a really good job holding the camera thank you so on to the story Bumpus Jumpus Dinosaur Rumpus There's a quake and a quiver and a rumbling sound. It makes you shiver, it's a thundery sound. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. The dinosaurs are coming, let's get ready to romp. Donk, donk, donk. Here's Triceratops, jumping up and down, doing dinosaur hops. He wears three horns, one, two, three, on his big bony head and blunders along with a bump, pump tread. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. The dinosaurs are coming, get ready to romp. Watch out for Dinosaurus with her snip-snap grin as she perches on her tail and twizzles a spin. Brontosaurus stops for a slushy, mushy snack. His tail starts swinging with a thwack, thwack, thwack. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. The dinosaurs are coming, get ready to romp. Pteranodon dives with a swift, sharp swoop. He shrieks out an eek as he swirls in a loop. Stegosaurus rumps along with lots of her mates. Clatter, clatter, clatter. Go her bony old plates. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. The dinosaurs are coming, get ready to romp. Styracosaurus, can you see the Styracosaurus? Styracosaurus shakes his collar and his spikes. Rattle, rattle, rattle is the noise that he likes. A pack of dinos... Dino... Oh, I can't do this. A pack of Dino... Dinonychuses. Well, there you go. A pack of Dinonychuses go running by fast with a zoom, zoom, zoom so they won't be last. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. The dinosaurs are coming. Get ready to romp. Donk, bump, snip, snap, twizzle. Eek, swap. Clatter, rattle, zoom, zoom. Come and take a peek. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. Everybody's doing the dinosaur romp. Roar. roar, roar, roar. What's making that sound? The dinosaurs stop and there's silence around. Roar, roar, roar. Now we're shivering with fright. <gasps> can you shiver with fright? What can make a noise like that in the night? Tyrannosaurus crashes in gnashing his jaws, wallop on the ground, go his big back claws. He's huge and he's heavy, but all he wants to do is join in the romp. So why don't you? You ready? Let's do this. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. Everybody's doing the dinosaur romp. Can you do that again? Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. Everybody's doing the dinosaur romp. Get romping with T-Rex and stomp, stomp, stomp. Wave your arms madly. Make your feet go bump. The dinosaurs won't scratch us or bite us 
or thumpus. They just want to holler up a dinosaur rumpus. Shake, shake, shudder near the sludgy old swamp. Everybody's doing the dinosaur romp. But soon all the rompers oh, grow sleepy and slow. The rompers calms down and the sound drops low. The rompers drift together and tumble in a heap. Till finally the dinosaurs are all fast asleep. And now the only noise in the deep of the night is... <laughs> Dinosaur snor snoring till the next day's light. It's a bit of fun, wasn't it? So that was the story. Now for a poem. I wonder what poem. Can you hear the dogs barking in the background? What have we got? Oh, let's do Snickety Knocks. There you go. There's Snickety Knocks on his rather tired old horse. It's by Hugh Chesterman. Sir Nickety Knocks. Sir Nickety Knocks was an ancient knight. So old was he that he'd lost his sight. Blind as a mole and slim as a fox and dry as a stick was Sir Nickety Knocks. His sword and buckler were old and cracked. So was his charger and that's a fact. Thin as a rake from head to hocks was his rickety nag of Sir Nickety Knocks. A wife he had and daughters three and all were old as old could be. They mended the shirts and darned the socks of that old antiquity, Nickety Knox. Sir Nickety Knox would fly in a rage if anyone tried to guess his age. He'd mouth and mutter and tear his locks, this very pernickety Nickety Knox. On the next page is the balloon man. Can you see him with all the balloons? This poem is written by Rose Fileman. The Balloon Man. He always comes on market days and holds balloons, a lovely bunch. And in the market square he stays and never seems to think of lunch. They're red and purple, blue and green. And when it's a sunny day, though carts and people get between, you see them shining from far away. And some are big, and some are small, all tied together with a string. And if there is a wind at all, they tug and tug like anything. Someday, perhaps, he'll let them go, and we shall see them sailing high, and stand and watch them from below. They would look pretty in the sky. There. I thought you might like to have a look at the pond just very, very quickly. You haven't seen the pond for a little while, have you? It's looking beautiful. Ooh, fishes. I don't know if you can see them on the camera. There. And the duck house. And the flowers. It's looking lovely, isn't it? Well, that's the end of story time, my darling. So I'm going to say ta-da and let you go. I love you and I love mummy. And if you could do me a big favour, would you give mummy a big hug? And please will mummy give Holly a big hug? And a big kiss, nice big sloppy kiss from granny. Lots of love. Bye.